Hello guys and girls and welcome back to a brand new video today for a brand new match review between Trammy Rovers and Mansfield Town. Mansfield Town will come to Prenton Park this coming Saturday on the uh, 18th of February 2023, 3 o'clock kickoff at Prenton Park. Massive game for Trammy Rovers. We need to get back to winning ways as soon as possible because the last few games have not been great for Trammy. Yes, we've had a win in the last week but it just wasn't to be on Tuesday against Bradford we need to pick up points massively and quickly if we want to be in the playoffs which we are seven points off it now but can I see Tramiovers getting back to winning ways on Saturday I think it's going to be really difficult against a good team in Mansfield who won 4-0 on Tuesday against Carlisle away from home, which was pretty awesome. Obviously, scoring four goals in the first half, which was incredible. But it's going to be really tough for Tramway Rovers, in my opinion. We need to create a lot of chances in the game if we want to get a win. Obviously, uh, we did get beat 2-0 on Tuesday against Bradford. I didn't go the game. But we need to be a lot more clinical in games. We need to be more up for it and if we want to be winning games we have to be up for the game which we weren't up for the game so I'm hoping that we can get something out of the game on Saturday against Mansfield Mansfield have got some decent players in their team they've got a good manager in Nigel Clough obviously former um, Sheffield United manager former Burton manager but I've noticed that we've had uh, we've had a few decent wins over Nigel Clough's teams in the last few seasons can I see Tramway getting something it's going to be difficult but we will see what will happen on Saturday I'm hoping that we can pull something off but you never say you never say never obviously we have we we're good one game, then we we'll crap the other. That that's what Trammy is all about. We are good one game, crap the other. That's what we're like this season. So I'm just, I'm just hoping something can happen. Something will give us a good spark to the games and hopefully get a win. So my obviously their players obviously Ollie Clark is their captain. They've got um they've got Keller. Davis Keller Dunn, who is from Burton Albion, good signing for them. Other than other players they've got is um, uh, Lucas Aitkins, who used to play for Tom Rose, another great player in him. They've got Christy Pym, who was at Peterborough, which was was really linked for Tom Rose last season. In my opinion, I thought we could have gone for him, which would have been a fantastic move for him, but. It's just it just wasn't people for Trammy Rovers, obviously. But I, I'm just hoping we can get something out of the game. Obviously, Mansfield have won their last three out of five with two draws. I'm going in confident that we can get something out of the game. And hopefully, I'm hopeful, but we just have to see how things develop in the game on Saturday against a good team. Obviously, we did beat them last season, 3-2, on the Friday night, which was absolute quality, great atmosphere, great goals. Tram River scoring in the last last minute of the game with a Elliot Nevitt goal, which was incredible. But can that game be like any game to, on Saturday? Probably not, but you never you never say never. I'm I'm gonna go in optimistic that we can do something because I don't know we just need that we need a win we need to balance we need to balance and we need to go on a good run of form that is what we needed obviously with the players the players have not been great not all players have been great this season I have to be honest Matej Shield I think he's nervous he's massively nervous. I understand he's nervous, but he needs to be a lot more clinical in the games. If you want to win games, the likes of that, 
over than Bristol Cogley have been decent this season. Um, Turnbull been okay. Davis been excellent. Uh, Hawks been really good in the last few games. Um, Morris been decent ish. Obviously he's had a few stinkers, but he's he's been okay. Um, other than that, Hemmings he's been woeful in my opinion. Mumbongo woeful. Um, Saunders look looks really decent on the ball, but he needs a goal inside him, which would be fantastic. But I do think this game could be. A tough game for Tramiers and I think it will be a tough game. I'm hopeful that we can get something out of the game on Saturday against Mansfield. Obviously Mansfield are on a good run of form at the moment. Obviously being unbeaten in the last five. Which is really good for them. Obviously Nigel Cuff is their manager like I said. And yeah it's just going to be one of them games where we need the fans to be around us. Obviously Give them a bit of confidence for the game on Saturday. Um, we just we just have to see what will happen on the day. So, obviously, we do have Stevenage the week after, which is going to be even massive. If we can get something from that at the Lamic Stadium next week, which will be incredible. But... Yeah, it's gonna be one of them games we need to be we need to be up for this game if we want to win the game. So I'm gonna be going into the game hopefully confident. So my team news will be Joe Murphy in goal. He has to start, in my opinion. Um I'll have Cogley right back. Um Davis and Jameson in two set in the centre backs. Bristow on the left, I think Bristow's been actually decent in the last few games. I think he's been really good. I'm going to have... Midfield, I'm going to go Morris. Morris with Chris Merry. Merry has to start this game. If Trammy Rovers want the chance to win this game, Merry has to start, in my opinion. And I think he could do that, hopefully. And I'm going to have... Um, I'm going to have Hendry in midfield with him and I'm going to have um, I'm going to have Leo Connor on the bench I think he'd be good as a fresh and then comes comes on in the second half to possibly get us something out of the game which would be fantastic left back left mid I'll have Hawks and then my two strikers will be not Mumbongo not Hemmings. I'm gonna go for Saunders and Jay Burton. And my score prediction. I'm gonna. I'm, I, I know. I know. I said we're gonna get, get beat last week. I, said, I think it's a real. I said, we're gonna get beat. But I then I said. Then I'm gonna. I'm gonna say a two-one win for Tramway Rovers. My goal scorers. I'm gonna go for. I'm going to go for Jay Burton with the first goal. And for the second goal, the Tramier. Ethan Bristow. I think he's been really decent in the last few games. So I put him as our second goal. And for them, I put Danny Johnson for them. Obviously, Danny Johnson... Um, was at Walsall. Um, he was at Walsall a few months ago. Well, few, last season. Well, this season. But obviously, he's gone back to Mansfield. So I think he will get the goal for them. But I'm, ho I'm hopeful that we can get a win. And we need to start. We need to believe. We need to be where we want to be. We need to be more optimistic going into the games. And we need to be. We need the fans more than anything right now because if we want to be in the top seven, we have to start now. When I say now, it has to be done. So hopefully we can do that. It's going to be really tricky, but you, ne you never say never in football, do you? So let's just hope we can get a win. So I am saying that. 
Hopefully you guys enjoy this video, so please like and subscribe. We're on the way to 800 subscribers, so let's do it all together. So come on you boys, all the way super army, and just remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in a bit. I'll see you guys this coming Saturday, so come on you boys, all the white super white army. I like Duncan's YouTube channel, it's brilliant.